welcome back to my channel. Today's video is all about what's in my bag. I love these videos. I don't know about you, but these are some of my favorite videos to watch. I absolutely love them. I love seeing what people carry around, and I hope you do too. So the bag that I'm currently carrying is my Speedy B. It is my Speedy Bandolier, th size 30 in the um, Demier Abine print. This has been a great bag. It's a great bag for this time of year, especially when the weather can be very unpredictable. It's great because of the size. You can cram a lot of stuff in it. And I have not cleaned this bag out prior to doing this, so I'm not sure what all is gonna be in here. So we will just have to wait and see. But this is the one that has the strap so that you do have a strap on your arm. And I absolutely like love that about this bag. So, let's get into what's in the bag. First and foremost is my water bottle. This is in here because I just recently got home from work and I took this to work with me. So, this is my Swell Traveler, the 20 ounce size. I love this. Um, I take it with me most days. Most days I either have a Swell bottle or a Yeti cup with me because I'm constantly drinking water. So, this is the one that I was using today. And this is, the next few things are coming out of the little side pocket. I have the original Louis Vuitton um, textile card. I have the, I believe this is the key for the lock, and I'm not sure where the, I'm looking on the purse to see if the lock is on the purse. I do not see the lock on the purse, but here are the keys in a little um, pull drawstring bag. Not sure exactly where the lock is. It might be down in here. I have a movie ticket. Oh, and this is for when I went to see La La Land over a year ago. You can see I don't clean out often. Um, I have another set of keys for locks, but no locks. Then I also have, this is one of those um, things where you can hang your purse on a table. You can place it on the table and hang your bag by that. I don't use it often, but that is what is in this side. And that is all that is in that side pocket. So next up, I have a pair of sunglasses. These are the Key Australia. And I believe these are the Supine. I think that's what they're called. So yeah, these sunglasses are just thrown down in there. Not very smart. Next, I have the Goyard pouch that actually goes in my St. Louis bag. And what I have in here are some cards. Um, yeah, that looks like my insurance card. That probably doesn't need to be in there. I have my library card. I have Pet Petco. Um, that was on the side. And then I believe in the main compartment, I have a couple of receipts and some um, coupons. So this is where I tend to keep my coupons. Next, I have my wallet, and this is the Chanel boy style wallet. It's kind of the mid-size, and if you open it up, I have some cash, I have some cards, and then there's a zipper pocket that has some like loyalty cards in it. Next, reaching down in here, I have my Kindle Paperwhite. Um, I normally listen to audiobooks, but I am currently for Book Club. One of our books is... It's available on audio, but it's not, it's an abridged version, and I wanted to actually read the entire thing, so I've been carrying this around so that when I have some spare time, I whip this out and read it because the book is kind of long. It's like 700 and something pages, but so far it's been really good. Next up, I have a receipt, and this is a receipt from the post office where I mailed something. Um, then I have a coupon for Ulta, 20% off. Does anybody else have this coupon? If you do, let me know what I need to buy at Ulta. Because I definitely am not gonna let that go to waste. Um, I have my phone, my cell phone. Um, this is the iPhone 6S Plus. I love this phone, I've had it for a few years now. I've had no problems with it. Up next is da -da -da -da, my makeup bag. This is the uh, Louis Vuitton makeup bag in the GM size. Yes, it's big because I carry a lot of stuff with me. And we're going to go through this because I don't remember when was the last time I went through it. And I have no clue what all is in here. So, 
Up first is my Lancome powder. This is the dual finish. It is the powder that I have been using since I was in college. I carry it with me. I think that this powder can pretty much solve any problems that I might have when I'm out and about. Next up, I have a lipstick. This is NARS lipstick in the color Cruising. It's just a nice neutral color that really is kind of sheer, but I really like it. It makes my lips feel really nice and hydrated. Oh, I have a Sharpie pen. So that's a pen that I, I really do like. Next up, I have a small size Marc Jacob highlighter gel crayon, and this is um, a black color eyeliner. Then I have a small size, this is the Peacemaker Hourglass Lipstick. Love that lipstick. But you can tell, I don't need, I mean, who's going to need all this stuff? I really do need to clean out. Next up, I have a Guerlain Maxi Lash Volume Creating Curl Sculpting Mascara. Not sure I've ever even used that, but it's there in case I need it. I have a ton, y'all, I have... I have six lip glosses. I should be committed. This is insane. I mean, who needs to be carrying around six lip glosses? I don't even know what to say. Okay, let's we'll go through them. Um, I have the Chanel 716. That's what this looks like. Um, it is a matte kind of brown color, kind of similar to what, although I'm not wearing it, it looks kind of similar to what I have on. It's a really nice color. Then I have... 722, which is kind of a nude with a shimmer. How pretty that is. Love that. Then I have the Fenty Beauty Lip Gloss, which, oh, y'all, this stuff is so good. I love it. It's kind of a nude with a shimmer to it. It's just a beautiful lip gloss. And I like the packaging that it's kind of smaller. Um, then I have a small size Buxom in the shade Sugar. This is a great lip gloss. All these are great lip glosses, but I don't need to be carrying around six. Um, then I have a full-size Buxom in the color Katie. Then I have a Chanel 119. This is kind of a mauve color with a little bit of shimmer in it. It's really pretty. And I believe that is all the lip gloss. Now we are moving to lip liner. And I have three lip liners again. Why do I need to have, to have three lip liners? I have Nude Suede Shoes by NYX, which is a beautiful nude that actually needs to be resharpened. Um, this is the Marc Jacobs in the color Primrose. This is actually the best one probably to keep in my purse because it doesn't require sharpening. So you can just, it's always ready to use. Similar to the Marc Jacobs eyeliner. They're both good to have in your purse. And then this needs to be resharpened. This is the Essence satin mauve it's a great lip liner but again it needs to be resharpened what else do i have in here i have a hair tie i have a house key of a friend that i probably need to return i have a receipt for a local gift shop i have a lemire pooth that i can just do you like that? I have a Urban Decay eyeliner in the color Hustle, which is brown, which is crazy. I have a pen. It's kind of dirty, but it's this white pen. That I love the way these pens write. They write really good. Um, I have two more lipsticks. I have the color, um, this is the Coco Rouge, the Rouge Coco Shine 54 in the color Boy. It's a great shade. It's kind of a neutral shade. It's kind of sheer. It's a really actually perfect for your purse. And then I have a Bobbi Brown Neutral Rose Luxe Lip Color. And it looks like that. It's really pretty. Which is a good little size. This is kind of like a deluxe sample size, which is great for your purse. I have another hair tie. And then I have some change. I also have some Bos Boschia Pink Peppermint Blotting Sheets. And then I have some earrings. <laughs> These are some Bobble Bar, I think, earrings that are studs that clearly I lost the back on one, so I took them out and just threw them in my purse. 
And then there's some change in here. So yeah, so that is what is in this bag. Uh, I have, which probably should be in my makeup bag, I have some hand sanitizer because as you all know, flu season has been crazy this year, so I have been a little bit of a maniac on the hand sanitizer, I'm not gonna lie. I also have a Key Australia um, sunglass case, which I guess these sunglasses that I had on earlier should go in there, so I'll put those in there. Next I have, oh, I have another pair of sunglasses. These are the Ralph Lauren sunglasses. Love these. I think these were a Miss Gold Girl made me do it. Love those sunglasses, but who needs two pairs of sunglasses in your purse? Oh, I have the strap. This is the rest of the strap for my bag so that like if I'm out and about and I wanna go crossbody, I can connect the strap and the purse is able to go crossbody. Next, I have my little um, Midori notebook. This is the passport size. And I just have like three Midori notebooks in here and I've jot down notes um, like about video ideas, books that I wanna read, my grocery list, my favorites, all kind of stuff I just like to jot down in that book. Um, I also have the little Louis Vuitton clay and in here is hair ties. So this is where my hair ties should be is in this little thing, but um, so I just keep some uh, ponytail holders and things like that in there. Let's see what else. Oh, my keys. I have the Louis Vuitton six ring key holder. And then I have one more item and that is my Hermes Bastilla. And this is where I keep my change and some dollar bills down in here and I love this little thing. So yeah, y'all, that's it. That's what's in my bag. My bag is empty. Actually, I think there's some I think there's some change down in there. But my bag is pretty much empty of the exciting stuff that is. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Please um, comment below, introduce yourself, tell me a little bit about yourself, and give me some suggestions for videos you would like to see. If you would like some more luxury videos, I can certainly do that. If you want some more lifestyle, if you want more makeup, if you'd like some get ready with me, I'm going to have a get ready with me coming soon, I think, or it might go up before this one, I don't know. But I just want to make videos that you like to watch. I know what I like to watch, and I want to make videos that you all like to watch. So, I hope this video finds you doing well, having a fantastic day, and a great week, and I will see you all soon.